Welcome to Comcast High School Sports on Demand powered by MaxPreps.com. I'm Raf Nickerson. Tonight's game is a matchup between Dobie High School of Pasadena and Clear Falls High School of League City. The Dobie Longhorns are coming off of a 26-14 win over Clear Springs and are looking to stay in the win column before heading into district play. Last week, the Clear Falls Knights put up 45 points against Baytown Sterlington and held them to only 7 points. The Longhorns open the game looking like a team ready for league play. Quarterback Daryl Edwards hands off to Patrick Hurts, who moves the ball into the red zone. Hurst takes the handoff and he finishes what he started. Touchdown Longhorns. The extra point attempt is off and the score is 6 0 in the first. Now, in the second, Dobie is sticking with the ground game. Edwards is able to move the Longhorns all the way to the five-yard line. From here, it's up to Kelton Bailey. He gets the ball just across the end zone line. Touchdown, Longhorns. The point after attempt is no good, and the score is now 12 to nothing going into the half. It's 25. It's 25. Patrick Hurst stopped in the back. In the second half, it's time for the Knights to show off that ground game. Brandon Hayward off the left side for a long game. Carlton Muscat comes in to nail a 31-yard field goal, and the Knights are on the board 12 to 3. In the third quarter, Dobie 12, Clear Falls 3. Last week, J.P. Lowry rushed for 190 yards. In the second half, Lowry comes out strong. And for... Lowry takes the handoff and touchdown Knights. J.P. Lowry into the end zone. Muscat hits the extra point, and the score is now 13 to 10. Nice down by three in the third. The Longhorns need to get something going to slow down the Clear Falls offense. Edwards to Kelton Bailey. Fumble after the hit, and the Knights are going the other way. Next play, the Knights go back to Lowry. Touchdown, Clear Falls. The Knights are up 16 to 12 after the failed extra point attempt. After the Longhorns go three and out, the ball goes back over to the Knights. Check out the effort from Lowry. First down, Clear Falls. Collin hands off to Brandon Hayward, who powers in from six yards out for another nice touchdown. Cliff Falls picks up two points on an extra point attempt to make the score 24 to 12 with four minutes left to play. Dobie still has a chance, but Edwards pass is picked off in the end zone and the Knights going to win 24 to 12. I'm Ralph Nickerson and thanks for watching Comcast High School Sports on the Man, powered by MaxPreps.com.